An $8 million investment in downtown Pascagoula has city leaders excited. The city council voting unanimously tonight to give city center developers a huge tax break on the project. Tristan Rupert brings us a story. The winds of change now blowing in downtown Pascagoula. I believe what it means is the complete revitalization of downtown. I mean, this is not, this is definitely the catalyst that is going to allow people to continue to invest in downtown. Shannon Strunk and Cynthia Baber Strunk have owned the lot on Magnolia Street for seven years. And now, thanks to tax incentives, they're looking to brighten the downtown community. And city manager Michael Silverman stresses the city's tax abatement program has been key in redeveloping the community. We have seen a lot of folks come recently to take advantage of the residential abatement side of things. And from the commercial side of things, this has been a major reason for a lot of our downtown growth, along with the excellent work that our Pascagoula Redevelopment Authority has done in providing incentives to local developers. The Magnolia Street development would bring more residential and office space to downtown, and they hope young talent comes to work and live in the building. It is critical for us to get talent, young talent here, that starts here in their professional career and lives here over time. The Strunks believe the development will fill a void in the city and set it up for greater success in the years ahead. The problem is right now, there's just no real place for young professionals to come and live. Their hope that said professionals stay in South Mississippi long term. Reporting in Pascagoula, Tristan Rupert, WLOX News Now. And the tax exemption allows for up to an 80% reduction of all city taxes and the cuts can last up to seven years.